Have you guys seen any of these recent stories on the new 2024 Land Cruisers that some of these Toyota dealerships are trying to charge you, the consumer? Because if you haven't, the costs are absolutely just ridiculous. I mean, don't get me wrong. I think we can all agree the Toyota Land Cruiser is an absolute classic. It's a very beloved SUV. And this new body style is very exciting to a lot of Toyota enthusiasts. But the prices, what you see on the MSRP on the Toyota website, and what the dealerships are actually charging is highway robbery. So I actually found this article on Car Scoops this weekend. And when looking at some of these prices and all of these little add-ons that the dealerships are charging to get you into these nice new Land Cruisers, it's astronomical what they're charging you right now. So with all of the add-ons, one of the dealers actually had a total price out the door for a new 2024 Land Cruiser for $92,000. That is like 30, 40,000 well above what it should be selling for on the market. So this is what really caught my eye when I was reading this article. Look at what one of these Toyota dealerships here in Carlsbad, California, were trying to actually charge people looking at getting into this new Land Cruiser. What really caught my eye was the $3,000 add-on fee for this specialty tent. And also, they were charging the customers $5,000 just for some all-terrain tires. I mean, guys, I, you don't have to do too much diligence, but some of the best tires for all-terrain, whether you like all-terrain or mud-terrain from BF Goodrich, you can go anywhere, anytime at a Toyota place like Tire Rack, you know, big old tires, wherever you have in your location, look at the price for these tires for a set of four. You can actually get per tire right around $340. So it's going to come out to about $1,351 for four. Add another $500, $600, whatever your labor costs are to put the tires in. It's well below the $5,000 add-on fee this dealership is charging you, the customer, to get into a Land Cruiser. And don't even get me started on the ridiculous cost for tent because any standard tent job, I don't care how many windows you got in an SUV, it shouldn't be costing you $3,000. At most, maybe $1,000. So for many of us out there who are enthusiasts about our brand, whether you like Toyota, Ford, whatever, I think we can all agree that the market adjustments and all of these add-ons, bait and switch, whatever you want to call it, it's getting really tiresome, especially in today's inflation where we just want to pay a fair price for a vehicle. So in closing, next time you show up to the dealership and you're looking for a vehicle and you see the price is advertised and then they start showing you all these add-ons, honestly, I don't care how much you love the car. You don't want to put yourself in a negative equity situation and you're overpaying for something that's going to just fall in the next 10, 18 months, however much time it takes before people slowly just aren't as excited about these brand new cars coming out. With that said, in the event of the Land Cruiser, the GX, any of these new body styles coming out from Toyota to include the Tacoma, it is not worth it, especially with some of these prices I'm seeing for the Land Cruiser and the 4Runner. Just wait 18 months because these prices, $92,000, that is not worth it. Don't make the mistake of falling in love with it and making a poor emotional decision. With that, I hope you got value in today's video. I will see you guys on the next one.